ladies and gentlemen, combat challenge presents five freely rounds for the K1 Heavyweight Championship, sponsored by Harris Sisters. And in the blue corner, the one or two wins and one defeat. Weighing in the 102 kilograms from Halifax, Dion Broombridge. And his opponent, fire of the red corner, the record of 50 wins and three defeats. Weighing in the 120 kilograms, representing Total Fitness. He is the reigning, defending, combat challenge, heavyweight K1 champion. From Rancher in Bradford, the Honey Monster, Taryn Morphes! For the 12 Rapid Challenge, the item is a silent stud, Nicky. Hello everybody, welcome to Combat Challenge. We're here at Cedar Court in Bradford. Rich, we've got a K1 heavyweight title fight. I'm so excited. Sure do, 5 threes out. We've got Darren Moffat in the black shorts, taking on Dion Greenbridge in the white. Darren, we've seen fight a lot of times. Dion a few times ourselves. I feel like the, the, the current reigning defending champion, Darren Moffat, should be uh, should be the heavy favourite in this one. Strong yeah. kicker, absolute monster jaw on him and heavy hands. Dion, we've seen actually spark a few kids recently, so uh, we'll see what he brings to this. Yeah, definitely. Um, Darren looking very composed early. Massive body kick there. Yeah, really big. That's As he said, strong kick and shaking his feet out a little bit. Solid body kick there. Very solid. I suspect five rounds will not be required, but we'll see, won't we? Yeah. <laughs> Shakes his head. Shakes his head. Oh, he absolutely rocked his face there with that yeah, right hand. Time. His head snapped back off that uh, big right. Darren looking very confident, actually. Dion, uh, Dion eating a shot there, though. Yeah, he got a chill on Yeah, he uh, ate that fairly well. Wouldn't really want to stand too much in front of Darren. He's absolutely... Oh. Wow. Almost kicked him through the cage right into his there, Ralph. <laughs> that was a little bit 3D for my liking. Yeah, it was a little closer than I wanted to. Ate that kick well, though, once again. You know, Dion actually... Uh, He's a tough guy. He's a yeah, really tough, tough tougher, guy. Than I, tougher than I remember, if I'm honest. Darren, uh, Darren looking very happy. Very content stand and trade. Eating shots, very pleased with himself. Big left hook That's there. a terrifying thought, isn't it? Yeah, you don't a really want to be... A holy monster coming at you. Dion's looking... Uh, Looking on his last legs already, and we're already partially way through the, route, the first round here. A lot of power there, though, from yeah, Darren. A lot, a lot of damage power. going on. See the size of the legs. Yeah, Darren's just a big guy all over. He's yeah, a, just a big, huge. big human. So steady away at the moment. Nice and controlled for Darren. He's, uh, he's in, he could be in for a long fight, potentially. Um, yeah, Darren's looking very comfortable in there. He's, you know, he's the champion for a reason, Rich. Yeah, he's looking, he's looking solid. He's defending, defending his head there, asking the guy to come on, throw some shots. But uh, Darren looking very much uninterested, really, in the offense. A couple of nice left hands there. Takes your guy down to the floor again. Let's see if Deal's going to answer this count. He does. He does, but I'm not sure how much... Uh, how much fights left? Well, he can, only, he can only afford to get dropped one more time before they'll finish it. Three, uh, three knockdowns, only one round. Even if there are eight counts, will be, uh, be the end of that, the end of the fight. Dion just needs to just go. Just needs to, he needs to throw his hands and hope for the best because uh, he's not looking like he's, uh, he's going to run away with this fight. To be honest, Darren just standing in the middle, drawing out ever so slightly. You see the damage to the body though from uh, yeah. some of those kicks already. Big leg kick. Massive leg kick there, goes to the Ooh. head. A <laughs> <laughs> Oh no, he's stalking him, Rich. This is unpleasant. Yeah, it's not, it's not fun you. watching. Oh, goes to the, he's at the point where we're spinning kicks now. I think he's having it very much his own way at this point in time. I think so. Darren drawing it out, enjoying it a little bit. Dion throwing that. I see a mark on the uh, left part of the body there yeah. of Dion. I would imagine this will... Uh, be finished sharpish in the second round if I'm honest now. I, I, mean, yeah, I, I just mean, don't think Dion's got much for him. I, I, with no disrespect to Dion whatsoever, I, I do believe that Darren is kind of toying with his food at this point. Yeah, it's uh, he's very much under the paw, isn't he, at this point in time. Yeah, I don't know, it's, not, it's, it's nice to see Darren out there pacing himself, yeah. uh, being technical, and, and, and just getting those minutes in the cage back again, you know, because it's all experience, all building into his own skill set. Yeah, that's right, that's right. You, why not enjoy it? Why not enjoy it? Do you know what I mean? I mean, it's... Um, we, we have seen Dion knock guys out, so you know, I don't think he can take it incredibly lightly, but he is very much, based on that first round, having it all his own way. Uh, he's not really eating much in the way of offense. He's, he's got Dion very reticent to throw shots back. 
um, and he has just got bullied around the cage really but we'll see what this second round brings yeah, I would see. be confident in a in a knockout in this round I think you're probably right Rich although you know, we're talking heavyweights here and they, even, even the tired heavyweights going to throw some serious yeah, yeah, and yeah. arms about so we'll never say never but I think you're right this is a uh, Darren's fight to lose at this point, I believe. Yeah, I mean, like I said, anything can happen, Al, but I'll, uh, I'll be looking for I'll be looking for Darren to have had enough now and, you know, look to make a statement defending that belt. You don't really want to be, you know, a round or two is not so bad, but you don't really want to be, uh, be messing around to this point. Like, you know, some big shots there. Darren now stepping up the pace quite considerably. Oh, nice shot there from Dion. Darren firing back there now. Not still down. And that, I believe, Referee is that. Referee calling that. Darren Mockett successfully defends his K1 title here in Bradford and he makes it look easy, Rich. Yeah, he did very, very well, very, very well. Looks very solid, looked calm, looked composed, um, looked more confident we've seen it recently. Yeah, I'd like um, to see uh, see the next uh, step up in competition for uh, for Darren, to see him get challenged by some of the other, uh, yeah, other players on the roster. Be great absolutely, to see. but you know, it's, there ain't that many big guys around that will want to stand in front of Darren Mockett. Absolutely. Great fight, well done. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Simon Stedley posts on the contest at 27 seconds of round number two. For your winner by TKO, and still the combat challenge, heavyweight K1 champion, the Honey Monster!